You're watching Good Day Las Vegas with John Langler, Heather Mills, Sherry Swensk, and Nate Tannenbaum. Good Day Las Vegas, live, local, now. Lutheran's Conservatory of the Fine Arts, they want to invite you to go exploring with Coraline this weekend. We're going to talk about the show that opened last night. We have the Dean of Fine Arts, Dr. Emily Slater. Hi, Dr. Hey, Slater. how are you? I am mostly sunny. How are you? Good. All right. We also have Logan Tomlinson. She's playing Mrs. Forcible yes, in am. the show, Coraline. So you guys opened last night. I hope everything is going great. Absolutely. Um, so tell us about the show. If someone is not familiar with the show, Coraline, what, what are you guys doing? Well, the show is about a young girl who realizes that she's not the center of the universe when she finds another world outside her own. So it's a really important lesson that she learns and she meets these great people along the way and ends up saving the day. But apparently, uh, from what I understand, you, your character gets stuck on the, in the alternate world or whatever you want to call it? She certainly does. She's actually part of the alternate world. Yes, I am. So my character is super extra. Um, she <laughs> just goes out there with everything and shows everything. I'm extra in the real world and also in the other world where I perform my monologue. Yeah, so I, I, from what I understand, Coraline has issues with her real family and then they try to get resolved in the Abs other side? Absolutely. She thinks that nobody loves her, appreciates her, understands her, so she goes into a world where everybody does, but that's not everything that she uh, hoped it uh, would be. So your character, Mrs. Forcible? Yes. Uh, tell us about your monologue. What are we going to hear? Or do you just want to go into a little bit of it? Yes, I will love to go into some of it. All right, so okay. he, she's in character. She's got this skull here. Yes, I do. Okay. To be or not to be, that is the question, Coraline. Whether it is nobler of the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune, or to take arms against the sea of troubles and by opposing them, end them. To die, to sleep, to die, to sleep, to sleep, perhaps to dream. Ah. Oh. Wow, <laughs> that's pretty strong. So uh, how many more performances do you have to go and how do we get to go see you guys? Well, there's a performance tonight okay. and then there's two on Saturday and one on Sunday. There's a Sunday matinee. Please join us on our website at faithconservatory.com and you can get your tickets there. How many students are in the cast and is it a big deal? It's a big deal to get cast in a show like this because it's a very small cast. Okay. So yes. How many kids in the cast? I think 12, is that correct? Um, something like that. Something like 12, and then we also have a tech crew of students as well. Oh, so for sure. So it's a large group of students. And you guys have work. been putting on productions there for quite a while. 22 years. Yeah, and this is just the latest in a long series of great performances. Absolutely, we've got more on the dock as well. So you can see all of that information on our website, and we'd love to have you come join us for all of our shows. Awesome. Well, Dr. Slater, it's a pleasure to meet you, and thanks for doing that great work from the cultural arts for our students in Southern Nevada. Logan, good luck to you. That was awesome. Thank you. I love I love the skull, I love the outfit, and I can't wait to come see the show. Thank you. Chrissy, our uh, producer who was uh, working with that interview, uh, wanted to make sure, wanted to know if uh, Logan did her own makeup, because uh -huh. it was really fantastic. Impressive. And she did. Did really? she? Yeah. Wow. Yes. Impressive. Multi-talented. Who did the makeup on the skull, though? Uh, I think that was a melted candle. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, stage makeup is always so exaggerated because mm -hmm. you have to see it from way back, yep. you know, in the audience. Mm -hmm. So when you see it up close, it's like, wow. That's and, pretty neat, though. And the talent of high school students, mm -hmm. really cool. Go check it out over at Faith Lutheran. Yeah, yeah good stuff.